What's up, YouTube? It's Hayes. Hey, hey, hey. Also known as a shoe vet, by far the coolest veterinarian you're ever gonna know. Hayes underscore TSV is where you can find me on IG. And today I am pumped to bring you guys this video. As I've mentioned before in previous vids, my milestone to hit 200 has now been completed, so we can get along with that giveaway. That will be at the end of the video. I got a quick unboxing of a whole bunch of clothing that I picked up over the past couple weeks. Actually, past couple months. Yeah, actually the past couple months. I just haven't been able to get it together yet. But with that being said, let's go ahead and hop into it. All right, so these first two pieces are pretty simple. Pick them up just round about at the mall, Forever 21. They weren't really that expensive, but I did pick these up for a certain reason. All right, so the first thing we got up is this shirt from Forever 21. It's in this really nice golden brown color. And it has like, it's like a really soft like corduroy material. And that's why I got this. It's like a soft as sheepskin, man. It's like ridiculous how plush this thing is. I mean, I don't really know if the camera will do it justice right here, but it's silky smooth. I'm not gonna put it on. I've already tried it on the store. It's a pretty, you know, standard, true to size, small shirt fit. Doesn't really fit me oversized or anything like that. And just the basic t-shirt. I really just like the color and the actual material that it's made out of, man. Cause it's, oh, oh man, I can like sleep on this, man. And is it me or is my beard? Like my barber did like the craziest job today. All right, now here's the second shirt. All black. This one I think it fits, it's a little bit bigger than the other one. So slightly oversized, even though it's a small fit. Uh, it's made out of just polyester, cotton, and spandex, and I just kind of just like the feel and softness of it. I also do like how rich this black is. I really don't think you can really tell on the camera, but it's not like a faded black. It's like a, well, true black, if that makes any sense, you guys, and I hope it does, because otherwise I sound like crazy, man, and that's not cool. That's not kosher. But yeah, man, I I just really like the, the richness. <laughs> I just like the color of it. It is pretty comfortable. A little bit oversized. I kind of wish it was more of a true to size. It'll probably shrink later on maybe it does have a lot of spandex and polyester in it though um but overall man, so i mean it was a pretty good pickup it wasn't really expensive really at all so that's that okay let's go let's go open this one first. okay so this is from culture kings i've never bought anything from culture kings before i honestly didn't even know about them until this collection dropped it's been out for a little while and i put it on my shop tagger no i'm not sponsored by shop tagger but should shop tagger see this video in the future at some point in time put your boy up just hit me up anyways my shop tagger alerted me and said hey this is going out of stock do you still want it if so you need to get on up here and purchase it and i was like okay that's my cue i need to get on and purchase it so comes in a black bag culture king whoop, whoop, big c on it now again i'm not exactly sure when this dropped uh, originally but they had like a pokemon collab uh they had a hoodie they had pants they had a button down shirt they had a regular t-shirt and i want to say that was about it though so for whatever reason i got just the button down and the pair of pants i don't know why i didn't get the hoodie because the hoodie is pretty tight they had it in my size yeah i don't know why i didn't get the hoodie oh well anyways let's take out the pants first okay so now the reasoning for this buy is honestly strictly nostalgic purposes uh, i fell off of pokemon back when i think after like crystal i think postmon pokemon i think pokemon crystal was probably the last one that i bought slash paid attention to all this other stuff i don't know what the heck is going on but yeah this is bringing back to me to the original I mean, you have all, you know, OG Pokemon on here. So you have Mew, you have Meowth, you have Eevee, you have Squirtle, you have Charmander, you have Pikachu, and you have Cubone, you have Bulbasaur, and let's see, I think we already have said Squirtle. So yeah, it's pretty much just all the OGs and you have them, you know, all spaced out on different areas of the pants and i just think that's a really cool detail on the side of the left pocket you have criminal minds kind of in this little silicone and branding on it and i think that's the only branding on here there's a zipper in the back no branding on that oh this pocket's kind of deep too though uh, i got this in a true to size small so we're gonna fold this up for right now i think it's all cotton material too as well let's check it out let's see made in turkey da, da, da. um who knows we're just gonna say it's all cotton because it feels pretty cottony all right bah. okay all right so we're gonna take out the button shirt all right culture kings world famous for streetwear all righty okay so basically the same prints as before concerning the pokemon selection Mew, squirtle cubone eevee bulbasaur charmander pikachu and meowth Yep, that's about it. Okay, well, that's that. 
All right, and our next to last unboxing. I actually feel like I probably should let this one go last because this is what I'm mostly excited for though. Uh, from the pictures that I've seen online, I think the details in this looks pretty great. And I'm actually upset that I slept on this. Let's just go ahead and get in it. Ooh, okay, well that's embarrassing. All right, now we got the highest in the room, Travis Scott shirt, that tie-dye shirt. This is the, I think this was the first shirt that came out uh, back when all the shirts and hoodies and stuff were dropping. And this sat for I mean, about a day. And then when I realized, I was just curious. I was like, you know, I think I may just cop it, sold out of my size because that's just my luck with everything. Ooh, gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Okay, all right. Full tie-dye shirt, got the swirl in the front, Cactus Jack logo in the upper, what, left? Yeah, upper left part of the chest. On the back, you got this really weird, but still pretty cool, like, alien man looking thing. I don't even know how to describe, how would you even, how would you describe this? I don't even know. But that says highest in the room, of course, to promote the song, uh, and it's a pretty dope song. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to cop the trap. Got sixes though for retail. <laughs> but anyway, so, uh, dope shirt. All right, and now we're at the grand finale. The last two things that we got to unbox, or technically, I guess, unbag, because they're not in boxes. Come on, hey. So one of these shirts, I mean, they're both from Fear God, in a way. One of them is from the actual pop-up shop that he had, uh, what, that ended, what, November 3rd, I think. It went all through October. The atmosphere was super dope. Wish I could have went, uh, but I did have a friend that was able to go and pick this up for me. The other came straight from the Nike store. Let's go see which one comes out first, though. Okay, all right, it looks like it's the Nike one first. Okay, this is the basketball warm-up shirt. They did do a restock of these. I think that I think it happened when the oatmeal dropped, which, of course, I got an L. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But we're not mad, Nike. Not at all. Not at all. Oh, okay. Now this is a pretty, okay. Pretty cool looking in person. It says it's their Nike, um, the Nike Air Fair God warm-up shirt. You have a Nike swoosh that's right below the neck, and that's it. I think that's clean. That is really clean. I think that's a dope look. I will get my you know, applause to that. It's, it's subtle, but you already know what the deal is with it being Nike at least. And then on the back. You have Air Fear God on the back, written in that pretty cool cursive writing. I think that I think this shirt is really well done as far as branding and everything goes. It looks kind of big though, so I would say it's probably a little bit oversized. But I mean, there's really only way to find out. Yeah, fam, this is a this is a little oversized, a little on the big size, but you know, that's the style. <laughs> Like almost halfway down on my knees. This is a small too. This is for my measurements from five, six, five, seven. You know, short game club, whatever. It feels good though. It feels soft. I do like the material of it. I kind of wish it was a little more true to size, but I mean, hey, can't complain. Kind of already. I kind of knew what I was gonna get into with it being fear of God, but hey. All right, and so now for the last and final piece that I got, the atmosphere exclusive. Pretty much the only thing I was able to get aside from the shoes I reviewed earlier. Make sure you watch that video too. The link is gonna be in the description below, guys. Thank you. But yeah, uh, one of the other. <laughs> this is one that. This was one of the more easily. Uh, this is this was one of the more easily accessible exclusives there. I mean, because stuff was just running out of stock left and right, especially in the smaller sizes. Open up the nice little plastic bag. I do enjoy these bags that they give you. Open it up. All right, so we got the essential shirt, boxy logo shirt, a plane on the front. Yup, but on the back, bam. So we got the essentials branding. We got the essentials logo at top, but then you got that Los Angeles on the bottom, thus letting you know that, hey, this was exclusive uh, to the atmosphere, okay? The ones that were generally released just has essentials on it, if I'm not mistaken. You hopefully can pick it up, but if not, just know that this is 3M. So, yeah, it's definitely 3M and flashy. I don't know, is it picking up the flash? No, maybe not. Okay, all right. But no, this is clearly oversized, though. We're still gonna try it on. Yep, definitely oversized, you know, but again, that's the style. <laughs> I think I kind of like this one a little bit more than the Nike one for whatever reason. I don't know why. I failed to mention there is a little bit of branding on the bottom left part of the shirt. Essential Sphere God. That's kind of embossed in there in black. I does not notice it because the shirt is black too as well. But see, but let me show you guys a comparison between that black shirt earlier. You see, 
You see, that's that's what I mean as far as the richest of this black. It's a lot, I don't know, blacker. <laughs> this black is just so, it's just so full and rich, you know what I mean? Uh, and I don't really find black shirts this, well, black that often. It's usually like this kind of washed out sort of kind of black, you see what I'm saying? So yeah, that's why I really wanted this shirt. That makes more sense, okay? Now, this is gonna be the part that you guys have been waiting for the giveaway as of right now i have 33 comments under that video explaining you know their favorite animal stuff like that so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna pick a random number i have a random number generator i have a random number generator i'm gonna pick a random number between 1 and 33 and then i will dm them and just check and make sure they're following me on instagram at hazel underscore tsv where everything checks out i'll let them pick send it Boom. All right, so we got one to 33, no repeat. There's a setup, one to 33, and then, all right. Let's say we got eight. So I'll go to my vid, and let's see here. Let us begin the count. It's not from, this is excluding my pinned comment too. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, looks like Golden Mystery X. The all animals my favorite. I like dogs, cats, hamsters, fish, horses, and so on. All of them don't understand us. They're not just animals. They also have feelings. Liked. Excellent comment, especially being a veterinarian. I love it. All right. So yeah, Golden Mystery X, I will be DMing you. Uh, make sure you let me know what your Instagram handle is too, so I can just check and make sure that you can follow me. And uh, yeah, everything checks out. We'll get your address and everything. And get things going so something happen well of course we draw and then i'll just communicate uh with whoever wins and we'll go from there but all right guys that's it for this one i hope you guys enjoyed this video but all right guys that's it for this one i hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as i did bringing it to you guys we got a whole lot more things in store i want to thank you guys for me 200 that's a huge milestone for me i honestly don't know what my next milestone is to be honest with you i'm not really trying to be too focused on subscribers i really just want to better my content for you guys uh you guys have been rocking me for a while so i can't thank you guys enough and i'll see you guys on the next one Peace.